Hi, Claire. I don't get out to see anybody at all. I still have that foundational, intense desire for human connection. Not for you. That's not for you. Claire is my best friend. I talk to her the most. I hang out with her the most on small walks. I definitely give her the most belly rubs out of anybody in my life. Oh! I think I was born with agoraphobia because I remember as a toddler looking up at the sky, worrying about gravity not working and me just getting sucked up. And when I look up, all these feelings immediately rush into this. The feeling of being unstable, the feeling of intense dizziness, the feeling of lightheadedness. I was walking down the main street in my neighborhood. This woman was talking on the phone, and she said, Steve and I can't really do the 17th, can we do the 19th? This small detail of this person's life just reminded me how she has her own unique ex like life experience. Her own, she has her own life. And of course, instead of capitalizing on this moment of existential wonder by going home to write some dense essay with a lot of big words in it about how insane so many people exist in the world and I just have my own little small experience. Instead of doing that, I of course had a panic attack. I've been diagnosed with clinical depression, general anxiety disorder, panic attack disorder, ADHD, I'm forgetting one. Oh, and agoraphobic disorder. Going to the dog park, going to the dog park, We're going to the dog park, me and Claire Bear, always and forever, going to the dog park.